We are now at the end of row 33, and we are going to join here. I just finished the uh, last single crochet. We're going to chain two, double, uh, no we're not, we're going to chain one, sorry, we're at the join. <laughs> chain one, and we're going to half double crochet in the third chain of our chain five. So I like to go into the whole chain. It is totally up to you. You can, I like to go into the chain space. It is totally up to you. You can go into the third chain if you wish. Maybe. And half double crochet. Well, that's not even, that's not even right. And do a half double crochet like that. However you choose. I like the look of it going in the chain space. Just like that. I'm going to mark it off. Row 33. And now we are going to row 34, chain four. One, two, three, four. Half double crochet the next chain two space. Chain two, my hands are a little damp from washing them still. Still a little damp from washing them. <laughs> chain two, half double crochet the next chain one space. That's that one right in between our singles. Chain two, half double crochet the chain two space. Chain two. Half double crochet the next chain two space. Chain two. Next chain one space. Whoops. Yep. Make sure I went in the chain. Chain two. Half double crochet the next space. Chain two. Half double crochet the next space. So we're going to do that all the way around chain two, half double crochet the next space, chain two, half double crochet the next space, and so on and so forth. And I will meet you back at the beginning. Okay, we have come around to the end of row 34. I just put my half double crochet in the chain one space. Now we are going to chain two and half double crochet in the second chain of the chain four. So again, you can either put it in the second chain or I put it through the space. Half double crochet that. Mark row 34 off. Now, row 35, we are going to be working the following rounds on the top half of our project only. So if you have been keeping track and your numbers are pretty close, this round should be fairly simple. So round 35, chain 3, double crochet, the next chain two space, chain one, double crochet the same space. We're going to do this 171 times. So again, we are going to double crochet the next chain two space, chain one, double crochet. There's another V stitch. Oops, I'm all tangled up. Okay. 
if you want to go on ahead and put a stitch marker in at your 171 uh 171 stitches because that's how many v stitches we need you go on ahead count 171 and mark it that way you know you don't have to keep track And when you get to your stitch marker, you know you have 171 V stitches. So again, I am going to put you guys on pause and I'm gonna do these behind the scene. All right, so we are now at the end of row 35. I put a stitch marker in and I did 171 V stitches. So I'm going to mark row 35 off. And we're going to finish this together. So the, uh, the very last of row 35, chain three. So we did 171. We are going to chain three. This is still the very end of row 35. One, two, three. Slip stitch the next chain two space. Chain three and turn. One, two, three. And we're gonna turn our work because we are still working only on the top half of our duster. Whoopsies. I can take the stitch marker out. Maybe. And row 36. Skip the first chain three space, which is that one. Work one double crochet, leaving last loop on hook in the next chain one space. Two double crochets. Okay, so we're going to make a cluster. A three double crochet cluster only on top only the top half so skip this is one double crochet we are doing a cluster wait a minute what did i do wrong hold on no that's right <laughs> there there's our three double crochet cluster Chain two, one, two. Um, another, I'm looking to see where in the world I'm at. Uh, another three double crochet cluster in the next chain space. In the V stitch, I should say. Chain two. Double crochet cluster in the next V stitch. Chain two. And we're going to repeat that all the way back to the beginning where our other stitch marker is. The beginning. Again, we're going to have 171 three double crochet clusters and I will meet you back at the beginning. We have made it around to the end of row 36. Um, I did my last three double crochet cluster and it says chain three 
skip next chain space, half double crochet, the next chain three space. So we're going to skip this one and go into the next one, half double. I'm going to mark row 36 off because I will get confused. So, and then turn. So we are now working on the regular side again. And we will be working around the whole entire thing, not just the top. So three double crochets. So chain three, one, two, three. Two double crochets in the first one. Three double crochet in the next chain two space. One, two, and three. Three double crochet. Okay, so we're going to continue in that manner. Three double crochet in every um, chain space, in every chain two space for 171 sets of three double crochet. One, two, three. So we're, I'm going to skip ahead with you guys real quick because uh, the last two rounds, we only worked the top part of our project. And round 37 is the whole part. But when we get over to the other side where we stopped and turned, let me find it. Right here. This is the other side. We would, I'm just going to go ahead so you guys can continue all the way around. We're doing three double crochets in all the chain spaces. When we get to the chain three space, it will have three double crochets. Skip the next chain space, which would be this one. And then two double crochet in every single space until you get all the way back around to where we are right now. Let's see if I can find my mark again. I seem to have lost it. All right, so again, three double crochets in every single chain two space. When you get to the chain three space, you're going to do three double crochets. Then after you get that, the three double crochets in the three chain, you are going to chain three, skip a space, and then three double crochets in the rest of the chain two spaces all the way around. I really, really hope I didn't confuse you guys. So the only thing you're doing different is putting, wait a second, what am I doing? Putting three double crochets in the chain two, oh my gosh, where am I at? In the chain two space, and then three double crochets in the chain three space when you get to it. Chain three, skip. We'll do that together. It just sounds so confusing. But you're gonna, when you get to that part, you're gonna do the same exact 
thing as you did when we started. Chain three, skip a space. That's it. But we'll do it together. All right, so we'll do one more chain or one more three double crochets together in a chain two space. And then uh, I'll put you guys on pause until I get over to that 171 stitch. And we'll do that portion together because I probably made it more confusing than I needed to. So I'll see, I'll see you guys there. We are now at the point in our row where we are on the other. Let me get all situated here. I got my yarn all messed up again. We're on the other side, the end, this is the 171. And it says, so here is the uh, chain three space. We're gonna do three double crochets in that one. Three double crochets in the next chain space. This one. So I'll make sure you see that. One, two, three. And then we're just going to continue all the way around. Three double crochets in each chain space. all the way around the whole thing till we get back to the very beginning where we are gonna slip stitch in the third chain of the chain three. We should have a total of 100, nope, sorry. We should have a total of 1,036 double crochets. 